TFAS actually started in uh, 2009, where a few of us um, used to play Sabutio, got together again after about 20 years. How I started playing Sabutio? Because of this guy, uh, yeah, we were classmates. I like football. Uh, I watch it every weekend. Um, and that time there was a Kalang Raw. I stayed off in Geelang at one stage with my grandfather. So the National Stadium was a big thing. I think the first time I saw it, it would be MPH, Stamford Road. And of course I asked the promoter how was it played and they showed me. Yeah, that's exactly like football. And of course you need another player to play with. So I'm the victim that he got me to his house, play and trash me over and over again. No, 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 no. it wasn't that bad. So what I do is uh, I will sneak Sabutio set in my backpack together with my books and things like that and I sneak out of the house saying I'm going for my study group and I carry it along with me and I went to play Sabutio instead. My mom found out because I didn't come home until late and she was like your study was so intense and then she checked my bag and found Sabutio. My mom basically gave up on me playing Sabutio. She said you playing Sabutio this weekend again? I said yep enjoy yourself. We are always trying to decide who's the better player among the both of us. Um, till this day, we can't decide. Nah. I can beat you. Goals can be scored in a lot of ways. It could be a tap in, it could be a long shot, it could be a top corner goal. But when you see people's reaction, like, wow, wow, you can do that. You know, that's where you get the satisfaction. You watch each other's body movement, facial expression, you feel each other's pain. Uh, <laughs> After our old levels, we went our separate ways. The game disappeared from Singapore. What actually sparked it off again for me is that 20 years later, uh, when I was moving house, clearing my storeroom, and I found my old Sabutio box. I went on the net, did a wild search on Sabutio, managed to find this organisation you know, that, that is still present in Europe. And surprisingly, they replied that there is actually a few guys con who contacted them as well at that time. Uh, it happens that they have a group of four or five of them who actually meet up once in a while to play. I joined them. I received his call. More or less by chance. Yeah. And the first question he asked me, do you still play Sabutio? And I said, yes, I remember, but I don't play it anymore. And he said, would you like to play? The group suddenly grew. Oh, and then we thought of, hey, why, why don't we try something to bring this back? We decided to form Table Football Association of Singapore uh, with the main reason that we want to bring back the glory days of this game, um, create the awareness, get players back together again, and at the same time, get new players to play the game, so, uh, to build the community again. We organise tournaments for players to take part in. We facilitate the forming of clubs. And as equipment is hard to come by in Singapore nowadays, we have contacts of suppliers and manufacturers. Yep. Now, we also start clinics to teach people how to play. Uh, the newer, later generations have not seen this game before. One important okay. point is family bonding. What we discovered the game can do is you can bond between the parent and the kid. They can interact over the game of Sabutio. When they get hands-on, they actually physically flick the player, score a goal, save a shot. That excitement grows within them. I'm getting my son to start yeah, the game. Yeah, my, my, my son is only nine. Okay, and with this, not only at the table, but at home. They discuss strategy, they, they learn the game together. Sabutio, with the figures as small as they seem, they have a global following. We have made friends all over the world because of this game. We have organised the Sabutio Asia Cup event in Singapore this year. Belgium, Italians, England. Austria, England, they're all here playing together and we all form friendship and you can see the passion in it. I think the main thing that drives us on is our passion for the game. The belief that... It can that, be that bigger. We, we 
love Servutio table football and we want to spread our passion for it all across the world, starting from Singapore.